we're going to talk about today is resolving conflict in our lives. Resolving conflict. Now, we all have some type of conflict in our lives. And what is conflict? Conflict is saying one thing and doing something different. Saying you want to have or be something and doing just the opposite. Saying I want to be healthy and strong, but every day I, I stop at the drive-through at McDonald's and eat french fries and, uh, and, and, and a Big Mac. Saying that I want to write a book, but I never ever get the time or take the time to start writing. This is conflict. Hanging around people who don't want what you what you want. Hanging around people who bring you down and, and, and bring your vibrations down and push you away from your goals and your dreams. Being in a situation that is contrary to where you want to go in your life. Having a job that you hate. Being in a relationship that is not good for you and you know it you know this relationship is not good for you but you stay in that relationship anyway because you are in conflict what you say and what you do are not matching up they are direct opposites and they are holding you back being in conflict is one of the things that hold back everyone in our in our lives conflict is that underlying conflict between who we are and what we say we want to be. Once we get conflict out of our lives, what happens is our lives start to flow. When we continue to operate in conflict and we do stuff that sabotage ourselves every single time, what happens is this destroys our underlying ability to have the things that we desire in our lives. You will not be able to prosper if you have conflict in your life. If you are saying one thing and doing another, if you are hanging with people that do not have your best interests in mind, if you are working for a company that does not have your values, then you are in conflict. If you say every day, I'm gonna get up and work out, but every day you hit that alarm clock and you stay in that bed until it's almost time for you to go to work. And then you get up and rush and say, I did not have time. You are in conflict. We must remove the conflict out of our lives in order for us to have a life that is moving forward, that is making steps, that is gaining ground, when we remove conflict out of our lives, what happens is we become free. We become free to do and have the things that we desire in our lives. Conflict will always hold us back. It will always stop us from doing the things that we want to do in our lives. And again, conflict come in many different forms. What we must do in order to get this conflict out of our lives is to examine ourselves is to sit down with a piece of paper and a pen and say, what is the areas of conflict in my life right now? What am I saying and not doing? What am I wanting to achieve and not actually bringing that thing to pass? Who is in my life that is a dream killer instead of a dream builder? What, where am I working? And is it in my best interest to continue to work here? Is this relationship that I'm in a relationship that is going to make me become my best self? And if not, I need to resolve this conflict. Your life will start to soar when you take stock in who you are and what you want to do. When your words and your actions line up, you will become aligned. And when you become aligned, your life will start to unfold. Things that you were having problems doing will automatically become easy. Why? Because conflict has been removed.
It is like removing that. And when you remove it, what happens is it clears the path for you to become and be and do whatever you desire in your life. This is Chef Inspire. We must remove that conflict. Take stock. Sit down with a piece of paper and write down what things are holding you back, what people are holding you back, what bad habits are holding you back, what rituals that you have put in your life, what routines that you have chosen to use as your stumbling blocks to stop you from reaching the higher heights and the deeper depths that you know that you can achieve. All things are possible for those who believe, but you must remove the conflict. You must have peace inside of yourself, that peace of God that surpasses all understanding that only can be achieved when you removed, when you remove that conflict. Who do you say you are? Are you living what you say you are? Are you doing what you're supposed to do? This is Chef Inspire. I hope you get this because once you remove that conflict, your life starts to open up. Dreams start to become true. And the things that you desire in your life become yours. You get this? You got it? Good. Have a blessed and powerful day. Remove those conflicts. God bless.